Your soul shall be mine! You asked for it. Wow, keeping the arcane explosion against an unknown warlock. What a disaster if he was running Giant's Warlock. But there are so many fast warlocks out there. It's like, I choose to keep I a dead card. You. The most extreme of circumstances. The light protects oh, me. Guessed right. The light protects me. So I could arcane explosion here. I think uh getting just one of them is good. Enough. In fact, poking both of them down one, that's pretty good. Like, whoops, I misaimed. It's fine, I can take two extra damage to kill off the wolf first. This guy is worthless once the wolf is down. <laughs> it's time for a little blood. Get in there and fight, maggot! This is better. My eyes are open. Put this apple on your head. Why do you fall? Alright, well, so far it's been a nice, uh, calm ride. I can develop the ogre without much fear. Although the ogre doesn't matter much since I'm up against uh, one threes, I'll just overkill them quite badly. But there's not much of a better play. I can do chill and yeti and fire blast the juggler, I guess. Somewhat reasonable. On the idea that I don't need to do that much damage, uh, the ogre is probably wrong. This is better. <laughs> That's actually a good shit target. The arcane explosion only kills a 1 1. I'll just do this. Save that arcane explosion. Next turn, I can ogre taunt. My choice is either to taunt the ogre or to taunt these two guys. I think taunting the ogre is best. Shields up. Wow, old Murkai. Doing business. Okay, please flame strike. Well, I have the second best thing. It's a consecrate, quote unquote. Ah, it didn't kill anything. I got this. Got these cold light sears at pretty good times. This time for sure. I need to 
draw the cards to hopefully get um, the, pain speak to me. the taunt guy. <laughs> it's time for a little blood. One, three, five, uh, five, seven, eight. Now, oh, thank goodness I maged him. Who you want me killed? Whew. Hold it out. For Doomhammer. You asked for it. Sucks. One of the things that I actually have too many of are four drops. Uh, that's partly because. Hello. Oh my gosh. That's partly because I don't have the legendaries. I think if I put Pagel and uh, Thalnos in, I probably cut a Yeti, so that this doesn't happen. Pretty gross, actually. It's rather unfortunate. Oh. All the mage cards are so blue. And yet he happens to be blue. Handy. <laughs> Got the basic fours and the five and the six. That was a really weird turn four by him, totem period. This is probably a, I mean, that looks like a terrible move. It's a setup for his uh, lightning storm. He's unfortunately going to be able to do 3 to 4. What I could do is Arcane Explosion and then Fire Blast the uh, Wrath of Air Totem. If I'm that certain it's Lightning Storm, I'm pretty certain. I... That totem needs to go. We hunger for vengeance! Okay. Drew out the Blood Mage Thomas. Make that work. My eyes are open. Hmm, why even attack it? My Let's go for his face. Are open. It's the blue crew. that useful right now. So this should be Fire Blast, which probably means I should play a Boulder Fist Ogre. Yep. Deal with Kieran the hard way. That's life. Huh. Maybe it was a Tink Master. It's a little hard to say. No, it must be a hex and he's just attacking first. Okay. Good, the healing totem. Mix 
makes me feel better when I flame strike. Help my damage. <laughs> it's time for a little blood. So I can do Ogre Golem, or I can do Drake Faceless. Ogre Golem, the what Ogre doesn't do? die to any of those. Do? Drake Manipulator, whatever hits the Drake will get Fire Blast, and the Faceless trades evenly. I also haven't drawn many of the I solutions wonder. in my deck, so the Drake could hit one. If I hit a Frostbolt, that would be really good. Time runs out on me. I think that card's about the best that I'm going to get, other than Ogre. You could have a uh, Ragnaros in there, but that would probably be waiting too long. Ugh. Wow, that totem. Fireball. Uh, he gets to refuel with all these Azure Drakes. That's a lot of spell damage. He hasn't played any lightning storms yet, so it's gonna be a five to six damage lightning storm. What to do? Oh. Huh. To bait it out one more turn. No, far too greedy. Okay, well, lightning storm. Is, uh, I thought that might be in his hand. That's pretty desperate. Of a lightning storm. And that was pretty desperate of an Argus. I don't know if he's been saving a hex for this. I think I have one more fireball in this deck, uh, which means I should definitely go for his face. I wonder if he was playing around Pyroblast. <laughs> That's possible. No, he just realized that my Harvest Golem would 2 for 1 him. 3 for 1 him. 2 for 1. What? It's bad fireball. But we are really limping to the finish line here. We gotta take that out because I'm not going to it. If he's running Leroy, then he must have like a bursty deck. Somehow I've taken zero damage. This is where that greed kicks in. Yeah, the Sun Fury Protector is less good than the Polymorph. Of course I saved the Polymorph. That's not greed, that's just reasonable play. Thing only has two health. Although it's 50-50 that he draws a uh, healing totem. But if he draws the healing totem, then I can Polymorph. And it will only have costed me, uh, cost me four health. Ah, missed the healing totem. Well, at least he 
thinks that I definitely have a pyroblast given this dodgy play. Hope he keeps getting that one one shot him. Do 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 My eyes are open. I probably should kill that with Arcane Explosion. It's the uh, less useful than Polymorph. Next. Okay. Maybe I uh, sheep the 2 4. Hmm. Alright. <laughs> we are both just hobbling to the finish line here. Hex the 3-3, three, three, Polly the 2-4. Where's my stuff? I mean, I only have five cards left. I wonder how good the cards in the bottom of my deck are. I don't remember I drawing very many Azure Drakes. I feel like I have good stuff in here, but I don't know for sure. This game's gone on so long I've forgotten like what's happened. Oh, that's pretty good. Right. Fueled by Pagel! Out of cards. Death by Pagel! <laughs> I sentence you to death by Pagel. So getting lucky with all those fish, huh? Would be a shame if you died due to overfishing. Two cards in his hand are both reactive. I <laughs> caught one! Caught some fatigue! Come on! Get some good RNG! Pagel MVP! Watch your back. You asked for it. The light protects me. All right, it's aggro rogue. Um, I'll probably want to keep the Sun Fury Protector, because he's aggro. Besides, that's a good target to Fire Blast. Alright, he slowed down. It's uh, good for me to Fire Blast that again. Because they tend to have a lot of buff cards. I'm sure I would have met a Shattered Sun Cleric. If I hadn't killed that. Well, no, I'm not sure because he had the coin. Hmm. Ah. 
Maybe that'll cry. Maybe it's not an aggro move. This guy's yeah, insane. it's like it's combo wombo rogue. I'll we'll go ahead and cast this even though it dies to the wicked knife because uh, it likely it might stop him from blade flurrying that in the future. It's dangerous to leave a rogue with a. Well, Your that's specific. No, it's not combo rogue. What is this? I don't know. It's not worth fireballing. Right? Job's done. Maybe you just got a really bad My hand. Shield for Argus. I think that's good enough to flame strike, or maybe fireball is more appropriate. Yeah, he he must have a lot of minions to run the buff cards, and he probably doesn't have very high health guys. So I should save the flame strike. Hmm. Probably the biggest card he has. I'll go ahead and Arcane Explosion? No. And I should kill that one just because it could lead to a 3 damage backstab. Out of cards after all. No, I won't flame strike this. That would be absurd. He's gotten rid of most of his direct damage. I've got one more in the deck. I don't have any way to clear his stuff if I use the flame strike. That's uh, four, six, seven, eight damage staring me down. I'm at seven. It would really suck to be at three. Hmm. But I'll kill this with the fire blast. No, I'll kill both of them with the arcane explosion. I'll just go six, seven, nine. All right. This time for sure. Ah, devil sore. That's very relieving to have a five-five. Ha! <laughs> this guy's toast. My shield for Argus. Yahoo! He's got stuff! The greed pays off for once. Well, it often pays off. Whatever, we keep track. Let the pain speak to me. Well played. Taunt wall is up. up. Shields up.
Wow, I was going to lose. What? That was a really weird deck, but it seems to be working somehow. Oh my gosh, two games left! Two games! Same opponent. Alright, this will go more in my favor because he was playing a really unorthodox deck. And this time around I'll know more about what's coming. Uh, this hand sucks though. It, yeah, it pretty much sucks. It might coin Acolyte. It's not out of the question. drawing um, at least two cards off of this, and I'll be able to kill off the Harvest Golem. I was going to send my Mana Worm into the Harvest Golem anyways, so that's pretty good for me. I encouraged it in. Job's done. Wow. And is, it's a hand. I've got a 4, 5, and a 6. It's fine. Just weird. Stand of this. Ah, this guy's no, side plus that. Cool. That rogue teamwork. Defeat the ogre. To North Ren. Apparently, you can. So I can either play ogre or I can flame strike. Flame strike saves eight damage. It's like reverse pyroblast. That's good enough, I think. Especially since I have the second one. If I didn't have the second one, I'd think harder about it. Okay, I'll break the symmetry. I was going to do the same play, but this is better. Seven mana, play the three and the three. Or do I do the three, two, two? I'd like the ogre to get taunt. I could ignore the. Nah. I, I don't want to ignore that. So my choice is ogre or harvest earthen. It's only two damage. Note to self, he's got Leroy. Better to get the ogre out early so that I can uh, protect it. Sun Fury it. Ha! This guy's toast. The light protects me. 
be a shame if uh, something happened to that board of yours there. Oh man, flame strike arcane. Oh whoa, one eight. Whoa! Holy value! Whoa! Wow. The light protects me. Your magic shall not save me. Fabulous. Remember, he's got Blade Flurry. Yeah, you can't have both. The poison. Pretty unlikely. My shield for Argus! Wow, I tickled. Gosh, one to go. I must protect the one. You asked for it. Pretty reasonable hand. And I'm up against the guy who uh, got rid of all his cards, so. My greeting. Feeling pretty good about this Hello? one. I am cautiously optimistic. Coin Harvest Golem next. Arcane Explosion tech is here. In the final game, the tech is real. Please no. Oh, ouch. It's okay. Doesn't look like he can do three damage to the Acolyte. In order to kill off the Ancient Watcher, probably want to send... Huh, it's tough. None of them really do well against it. What to do? I'm gonna need to uh, get a fireball, I think, before I can start attacking. I mean, I could poly it, but sort of want to get something better with it. Well, at least it was a two-draw acolyte. All right, got the fireball. Nice. Gotta save the poly for his uh cairn, which all druids run. Where shall I will never expect the arcane explosion double for the double kill. I'm pretty sure that would still be a bad use of arcane explosions. I should think about playing this slow, because if I don't play any minions, he can't kill them with his 2-2 uh, two -two and then his thing there. So I'll just do that. And then the next turn I'll Fire Blast the other one and then play the Earthen Ring Farseer. This uh, rescues a card. And the 
long term. And I'll need every card I can get, especially since he's got Ancient of Lore advantage on me. The uh, opponent's hand is monstrously large. Uh, eight cards, I will soon have six. This fight is slightly in his favor. And the cards in my hand are rather bad. Oh, did I lose? No, not yet. Hmm. Pretty close. Is that Earthen Ring Farseer Valley there? So I'm out of swipe range. This time for sure. I must safeguard. Oh. Okay. Well played. Darn. Well played. Ah, oh. oh. Marine Tank Okiopi. I must protect the wild. You asked for it. This hand sucks. Although I might want to keep Fireball. No, I need to get early game. He kept three cards. Alright, that's more reasonable. My hope is he... okay. My hope is he coin pagels and then doesn't draw a card and then doesn't have Wrath. But that didn't happen. Yeti would be good for me here. Oh man, that's really good for me. My two drop trades for the Yeti. Although technically I spent four mana on it. But that was a two for one. Hello. Early game victory. Small wins. The tempo against the Druid doesn't matter too much. Uh, except under the most extreme of circumstances, which happens sometimes, but on the surface that was really bad. Although he might not have had another option. It's possible. Amani Berserker is like the Yeti Slayer, and Mage is the only one who can use it. Alright, well that's two good trades I've gotten on him so far. So I've got quite an advantage. Hopefully it holds I out. Must safeguard the last. And now I have the surprise arcane explosion burst damage to uh, sort of two for one. It's the stand in for the missile. Here. A 100% successful missile. Although I have to pay the extra one mana for insurance. Huh. Through all that, somehow on turn 7 we have the same amount of cards. Well, I guess I've gotten rid of the coin and the uh, extra card advantage from going second. So that much is good. And the Acolyte of Pain will hopefully be drawing me uh, two, three cards here. This is the turn where he can play Ancient of Lore, but I've got the Amani Berserker as the five health slayer. <laughs> Looks like I'll only draw uh, two cards with that. That's fine. We could have set up to draw three. Um, 
but I think this is better. No oh, man, Faceless the Ogre. I haven't done this in... ever? No, I've done it before. Rarely happens though. Yeah, got my Faceless off on my value card. Wait a second. In this case, uh, playing the... this is way more mana efficient. Golden Ring Hero is here yet again. My gosh, I've gotten value on every single play. How can I lose? Please, no lose. Let's see, 16, 15. Where shall I strike? Nice, the ogre can uh, take out that one perfectly. Oh man, I got another ogre. Mish -mash. <laughs> can get some swipe value technically, but these are damaged goods anyways, so no big deal. In fact, if I play the Sun Fury Protector, he can't use the uh, hero ability and must use swipe. It's swipe or lose. Oh my gosh, it's Azure Drake swiped. Although that doesn't... Eh, it sort of matters. I must save oh, no swipe. <laughs> it's ogre for you. I got this. has no power here. Not even if it hits an ogre. Although I'm one short of lethal. Yeah, it'll work itself out. It's pretty good Ragnaros. My shield for Argus! Wow. So I need to do 15 damage? That should be enough. Yeah, nice swipe. Time for the rematch of the final boss. Well played. I must protect the wild. You asked for it. Feel less confident about this hand. I get Innervate Yeti I this time. Oh, it's Pagel. Okay. And top decked Pagel, which is good for me because uh, I have enough I to kill Pagel on the board. Wow, Pagel 0 for 1. A natural mistake. <laughs> the Yeti, most fearsome. Certainly cannot polymorph that. Play the water elemental the next turn I'll fire blast the Yeti Dan. Actually, I will be even greedier and I will uh, just hit it with the water elemental and not finish it off so I can play a Yeti. Uh oh. Six. To Northrend! Okay, well that's actually really good value for me because uh, I broke the divine shield off of one damage. Unfortunately, Fireball isn't good value. Hmm. 
guess I will live with this. Ardent Commander gets a uh, two for one on me. Although one of them was the like already dead mana worm, so whatever. And he has to use the shapeshift to kill off my Yeti. I must safeguard the land. Ah, in this setup, I will actually be able to kill the keeper. And the ogre pressure is on. This time for sure. Yes! Luck of the devil soars with me this time. That was huge. It often is pretty big. Um, nice. I got a minion. It's not the best minion, but it's a minion. And I can protect the yeti. Force the Tink Master to run into the uh, Harvest Golem. Or to run into something. His choice. My shield for Argus! Send that guy in, Fire Blast, and these two in that, I guess. Wait. Oh, that's better. I got this. For one instead of two, of course. Well, maybe I should have put him with the Yeti. That's okay. I had to check for a moment to see if I was sane, since the chat was telling me to flame strike. And I was like, "Wait, what? You want me to flame strike a Harvest Golem and a Defender of Argus? What?" I wanted to save the fireball for his uh, face, but this is fine. I've got a really good hand in the late game here. The hope is he's got three uh, low cards. That sort of counts as a low card. Come on, one more. Ah. That probably means he doesn't have any minions left, so I'll go ahead and uh, flame strike this. Uh, no, I won't. I would normally fire blast one of his guys, but uh, I've got the flame strike. And I was hesitating for a moment. It's like, wait, what if he has? Oh no! Oh no! No! Ah! <laughs> two cards and we were like halfway through decks oh, oh the humanity